Hey everybody, welcome to this video. In this video I will be unboxing toys from the new movie Despicable Me 3. Uh, can't wait for it to come out. Those movies are awesome and who doesn't love minions? I would love to have minions follow me around. Um, I don't have the full set of all these toys so this will be part one. Uh, I will make some more videos with the rest of the toys. So let's just go ahead and get started. Um, we'll do the small ones first, and then we'll just work our way around to the big ones. All right, here's the first one. This is Jail Time Mel. So I guess in the movie they're going to be in jail. <laughs> Seems pretty interesting. Let's go ahead and open this. Not the way I want it. How about we just use some scissors? Okay. All right. <clears throat> so there he is. Push him out. Okay. Here he is. Just a little figure. Um, they are posable. That's what the box says. But it looks like just their hands can move. So, and these small ones, that's all you can move. I'll go ahead and put him to the side real quick. Grab another one. Now, this is Jail Time Tom. He has a shovel and a pretty cool bandana on. Go ahead and open him up. And here's jail time Tom with a shovel. So I guess they put him to work. It's pretty neat. Alright. And then one more jail time, and that would be jail time Tim. He doesn't look very happy to be in jail. Actually, like Tom. Excuse me, Tim. Sorry. All right. Here is tourist Dave. So I have to assume that they go somewhere, another state, maybe another country. I'm thinking another country. Just based off the hat and the outfit. I could be wrong. Maybe they go on a cruise or something. There they go. He look, looks pretty happy. Oh, he doesn't stand very well. Okay. Huh. He has a hard time. Well, I guess he can stand. There we go. And he falls over a lot. Uh, this is protesting minion. Doesn't say who it is. Not sure what they're. Looks like they're protesting Gru. That's really strange. Like no Gru. Very strange. Wonder what Gru does. To make them mad. Wonder if the movie. Gru's brother shows up. I wonder if they start liking him more. 
screw doesn't push them away a little bit. And the design around his hands. Alright. Looks like he's sticking his tongue out. <laughs> okay. One more smaller one, and this is the bad guy of the movie. Uh, his name is Balzazar Bal Dazar Brat. Uh, I looked up what his story is. He had a show in the 80s as a kid. And when he turned 14, they basically canceled the show. And I think he got really mad and kind of just left and no one knows where he went. And now he wants to take over the world, pretty much. And he wears the same outfit as he did in the show. He actually, it looks like he has his own stand in here. That's pretty cool. Before I open this, uh, I want to show you guys the back. So, I have... Oh, me, uh, I have... Dave and the Minion. I don't have Hula Dave. I don't have Lucky or the Bot. But I have all the jail times and I have none of the Drews or Grues down there. That's the ones I need. So that's the other videos I'm going to make. Alright. Let's go ahead and move the camera over again. Yeah, that's definitely an 80s outfit. And he's got bubblegum. That was a big thing back in the day, I think. And there's his stand. He actually can move his hands too. That's pretty neat. Okay, his whole arms move. Oops. Pretty neat. There he is. Cool. We're going to move on to some collectible items. They're called Dorbs. Uh, they're made by Funko, if you don't know that. Um, they make the pop figures everybody likes. Um, this is Jail Time Phil. I have everyone on this here except Drew. Or, I'm sorry, Gru. I don't have Gru. I do have the other three. Normally, people would collect these and not open them. Um, but this is an unboxing video, so we're going to open this up. Sorry, collectors. Here it is. I've never had a Dorb. I've had Funko Pops figures, but I've never had their Dorbs. They're very cool. They don't do anything, but they're they're pretty neat. Um, very good quality. Feels pretty nice. Good plastic. Um, pretty neat. All right, let's uh, open up another one. Agnes. This is Kids Adopts. Um, she's awesome. Looks like she's a little bit older because I think she was just a little bit younger in the first movies. Looks like she just a tad bit older in this movie. I'm not sure how farther along this movie will be. I don't know if it's a couple years or just maybe a few months, but we'll find out. Pretty cool. There we go. Alright. Now we have uh, Hula Dave. So, hmm, if he's a Hula minion, so I wonder if they take a trip to like Hawaii or something. That's that seems uh, actually correct because Taurus Dave looks like he's looks like they're going to like a island. So I have to assume that they're going to Hawaii. Now that he's Hula Dave. Um, this is actually pretty cool. I like this. <laughs> Got the little coconut. That's pretty neat. Look at his hair. Um, it's really good detail, actually, that they do on this. Got the lay. That's pretty neat. Grass skirt. These are actually pretty cool. I like the dorbs. I'm about to start collecting these. 
obviously without opening them. But I will open them for you guys. Okay, so let's open these things. It's called minis. Um, they did a Moose Toys actually decided to do these minis for the new movie. This is a collector's tin. I think it, it holds some minis in it, and it comes with two. It comes with an exclusive robot, Clive the Robot, and it's got a hidden one, so I'm not sure exactly what's in it. Um, how despicable. Someone got their hands on the shrink ray gun and minified the minions and friends. Now the minions have become minis. Search for the Despicable Me 3 characters and collect them all while they're small. Um, if I'm correct, I think there's 75 of these to collect. That's actually a lot. Um, I have this tin and I have four of these over here. And there's one figure in here. Unfortunately, I don't have any more. But like I said, I'm making more videos, so I will have more for you guys. Let's go ahead and open up the collector's tin first. Um, I have to get the scissors for this one. This is the uh, package pretty good. And I'll probably be speeding this up so you guys don't have to watch me struggle with cutting this stuff. Let's cut this without cutting my hand off. Pretty neat tin. Just the tin without the minions, the figures inside would have been pretty nice. I'm actually really big into tins and stuff. Okay. So, oh, there we go. Oops. So here's the name in this bags. Uh, before, let me show you this. This is a tin open. You just put them in. You're good to go. So here's the little pamphlet that comes with it. Series 1 Collector's Guide. Um, so it's got a color coding. It tells you if there's any, what's rare. Ultra Lost. Hmm. Never seen that before. And, it, and then you see the what you can get, and they got colors next to them, and that kind of tells you the rarity of it. And yeah, there is quite a bit. Uh, Ultra Lost is called Unigoat. That's pretty awesome. Let's see what we got in here. I know you have the robot. Um, here it is. So these are. These are squishy. These little minions. They're they almost feel like an eraser, but not not quite an eraser. But it has that same feel. Pretty neat. I like these. Let's go ahead and put that over there. Okay, I got trash everywhere. Here it is. Let's see what it is. What do we got? It's a minion. He's holding a mace. Very happy minion. I'm sorry for the glare, guys. I just noticed that right now. I'm really sorry about that. I will do better next time. Um, these things are tiny, too. So let's see what we got here. Um, where is he? Masher Minion. He's right there. And he is a red color. And red is common. So, not a rare, but... Hey... Let's go ahead and throw these in my tin. Bam, in the tin. Oh, that was the front. Oh, well. Sorry, you're looking at his butt. There he is. Okay. We've got... Oh, I should have just kept... Yeah. Should have kept that over here, because I'm about to open up four of these. All right. This is... A little difficult to open, but... Try to do this without spending too much time. Okay, here we go. I'm sure there's a booklet in this one too. Yeah, I'm gonna get a booklet every time. These are pretty cool. You can hang them up. It looks like you can keep these to. Actually, these are really cool to keep uh, for birthdays, Easter. They're not quite egg shaped, but 
Hey, nice place to hide little toys. Oh, I got two of them in here. No, nope, just one. This is... Oh, I forgot her name. I should know her name, right? That's bad. I can't remember her name. That's Margo. She's a common. So, there she is. Right there. And it looks like she's got a stand? Yes. That's pretty neat. Here's her stand. Cool. Alright. Let's go ahead and let's put this together first. Move this trash over. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Oops. Cool. It's got a bath towel. Or I mean um a towel. He's probably at the pool. I have to assume. No stand on this one. Wait. That's really strange. That's really strange. There's no there's no uh stand for him and he's got a hole in his foot, so he should have a stand. That's really strange. I wonder if that was a accident. Alright, we're going to see which one that is. Um, vacation. Yeah, so they take a vacation, it looks like. Vacation. We have Beach Bum Minion up here. And blue. That's a rare. Look at that, people. We got a rare Minion. Minis. Pretty awesome. I like that. Sorry guys, I got some tape stuck to my hand. Okay. Here we go. I'm not sure there's an easier way. There probably is, and I'm just... I'm just you, taking the hardest route possible to, to get these open. Let's try this. You know, I'll we'll just go back to the way I was doing it. That seems to work. Whoa, I washed my hand though, so I don't cut myself. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Sweet. Look at this one. That's... Hmm. Uh, it's gotta be Minions Through Time. Yeah. Vibely Minion. Wow, that's a Ultra Rare. That's awesome. Okay. One more, and then we got four bigger toys, which uh, are really awesome. I can't wait to open those. Uh, next time I do these videos, I'm gonna find an easier way to open these before I do the video. Whoa, it's a minion baby. Cool. These all have holes on them, like they have, they're supposed to have stands. That's really strange. Only one came with one. Okay. Uh. Oh, baby minion. He is the very first one. And he is a common. So now. We're going to open up my tin and put them in there. Bye.
Okay, here we go. Time for some bigger minions. Ooh, ooh. Let me, uh, point the camera at that. Pretty nice. This is Banana Crazy Carl. I should have showed you guys that. Okay. I think he's gonna come out now. Okay. Cool. Look at all these bananas. Oh, he is crazy. If he turns his head, his eyeball moves. Whoa. So he pulled this forward. Sorry about that. Okay. So, move his eyeball. Okay. Move this forward. Whoa. He push it. Okay. Pull it down. Hit the button. Puts his hand up. And now he's eating a banana. And he's got a bunch of bananas. Did this go somewhere on him? On his head? Yes. Yes. See? Bam. Now he's got a banana head. That's... That's a lot of bananas. Can't believe one, one person likes that many bananas. But, they are pretty good. Cool. That is Banana Crazy Carl, and he's pretty banana crazy. Oops. Okay, guys. This is Jail Time Tattoo Tim. So, bigger version of the other Tim. There's tattoos in here. There's some stickers, and you can actually put them on him. I'm very excited. That's really cool. Before I actually open this up, let's cut these. These. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Bumped the camera. Okay. Promise that my other videos will be better. Jimmy. He's got a shovel. He doesn't have a button, but his eyes move. Move his hands around. And my battery's gonna die, just a heads up. His shovel goes in here. So there, nice. Oh. Wait. Did I do that right? No, I did not. I think he's holding the shovel up. Well, either way. You know what? Never mind. Now I got it. Goes like this. I think that's correct. What does the box look like? Yes, that was these. Okay, I got it. Alright, guys, we're gonna put some tattoos on. Put a banana one on. Banana. Oh, I ripped it. Okay, got it. Well. Alright, banana sticker. Let's put it on his forehead. Banana.
dice. Okay. Put this on his back. <laughs> That's a banana with a chain ball, or I mean a ball and chain on it. It's pretty neat. Let's put that here. Let's just do one more. Cool. Camera died. Sorry about that, guys. So I think I was putting tattoos on him. Let's put a couple more. I was going to stop, but uh, I'll go ahead and do some more. And I want to take the time to apologize for the shadows and that light bouncing off the packages. Um, next video I will make sure that it's not like that. First video, so still trying to figure out you know, exact lighting and all that. Uh, put one on his back. Alright, so that's jail time Tim. Let's move along. Now this one is Build a Minion Dave and Stewart. So you can make him Dave or you can make him Stewart. And looks like he's got Google Actually, take. Oh, that's still on there. Okay, so here he is. You can move his feet, I believe. Yep, arms. Um, oh, yeah. See, you can take him off. That's pretty neat. Um, not sure why you would want to take the body off. Because you only get one leg. But. How do you. Here we go. Okay, so he's on. You can take the eyeballs off. Well. Whoa. Bam. Boom. And you can even take this off if you want to. Just take that off. Cool. Okay, so let's, uh, I just got another hand we could take off. Oops. to put this on. Oh well. Okay. Let's do this since I only have two minutes left. This is Gru with freeze ray. Includes two ice blasts. Alright. 
That's pretty neat. Little button. See? Oh, that's not the button. Oh, no. Hmm. Can't seem to. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> All right. In this freezer, eh? Bam. That was pretty neat. All right, guys. We are done with this video. This is part one. Um, I appreciate you watching. I'm sorry for, like I said, the light and shadow. Next video, I will make sure it's not like that. Um, so, please like this video. Make sure you subscribe so that way you can uh, see the other videos that, that are going to be coming out. The other minions. I got to collect the rest of them. Uh, there's a few here. You see, I need the robot and Taurus Jerry. I think that's it. Well, have a good day, guys. Thank you for watching, and I will see you later. Bye.